Looks like the game started. We got Techno versus Colors. Rosa Main and a Rob Sheik Main. Although we actually, I don't think we've seen Sheik come out yet for Techno today. He's just more comfortable playing the playing the read game with Rob. We are underway. This is server to Palatina. The second Palatina we've seen today. Looks like Colors looked at uh, what was happening and went, Oh, Sylvanas, I think I need to show you how to play this character. Very surprising uh, choices this, this turn. We've got a Ganondorf, we've got a Mewtwo, we've got a Palatina. Always great to see them. Rob continuing to play the reads. This particular Palatina playing a much better neutral game than Sylvanas was, though. Saying, hey, I know how to use my forward air and back airs and my up airs. I know what's going on. I don't know, I really game's a little better than you, Rob. It might be a little bit more maneuverable, but I am wearing a dress. Techno says, eh, I know all about that, though. Excellent DI from Palatina. Here comes the read. But the counter... Everyone completely forgets that the character has one. We both decide to hit the stage and go back to neutral. Tina being the aggressive one in this in this battle. I suppose she kind of has to, being not the camper in this in this matchup. Oh, an excellent buckler to the face. Buckler must be made out of adamantium. She took Rob to the cleaners. Oh, good read, read on the roll. Besides that time, he's not going to try and wait. He'll go straight for it. Now it's a zero zero. We're back to square one. Rob perfectly content playing the safe camping game that he has. Not going to worry about the laser because he does not want that reflected. Not seeing it completely safe in most scenarios, but in this one, unfortunately, she's got to play the aggressive game. Ooh, jab to grab. Doing a good job keeping her spacing, knowing her spacing. Just waiting for Rob to make a mistake. Trying to bait out that laser. The Techno knows better than that. He's got his own projectile. He's got another projectile. He does not necessarily need the laser. Oh, reading the roll. Once again, Techno with his reads. Who needs anything else when he can read a roll? Techno takes the game In case anyone is wondering, in the back there we've got a little shop going on. So Rachel and ITT have made 
a couple of different uh, bead arts and buttons that people can buy. I was talking about how he, he chose Palatina specifically because he saw you play and was like, nah fam, I gotta show I gotta show him how to play it. <laughs> Back in around Dreamland. Uh, another one of Rob's uh, more favorite areas. Not, Palatina might enjoy it as well. I'm not really sure, but. I'm really surprised to see colors not picking Rosa uh, Luma in this. Rosa Luma in this scenario. Maybe he knows something I don't. We'll have to ask him. It has a little bit more room to kind of deny Rob the, the combos he's got. Good sidestep there. Rob's still doing Rob things, and it is Dreamland, which is exactly why Rob likes these stages. Lower ceilings, can he can get much earlier kills. Palatina missing that grab. Resetting yourself to neutral. Uh, doing rob things once again. Oh, almost reading that air dodge. With the platform saved. Almost reading the spike. That's something we haven't seen yet today, but that is also something Techno knows how to do. He doesn't have, just have an up air. He's got a spike, and you do not want to be hit by that. Good power shield, the call team. Rob, once again, reading the air dodge. Slight fast into an up air. She's done on Dreamland. Techno wins it.